So, you have a faulty UE Mega Boom. If it doesn't work anymore, why not open it up? What could go wrong? Could it be a faulty battery? Make sure you test your charger and cable first. Tip 1. Carefully lift the charge side. The first opening is always harder. Don't just start prying the board off like in other videos. The dusty one here shows a good silicone seal. Dig out the side silicone. The silicone is quite easy to take off. Here it's cleaned off the sides. This is what can happen if the silicone is not removed. The broken side makes the board useless. Now the UE Mega Boon is here is that replacement part off a donor board. How good is your micro soldering? Tip 4. Always remove the inner and outer plastic rings. These rings actually help seal and lock the board down. Don't just pry off the board as per other videos. Replace the two rings before replacing the board. Gently lever up from the front left and then from the front right. Once lifted a little, don't lift the whole board up. Grab the socket to lift the rear of the board. Pull this upwards vertically. This is what can happen if the board is lifted too much. The connector has fine tabs. Connector damaged, lifted and If the battery has a tab, grab that. Sometimes the tab breaks or the battery has no tab. If there is no tab, you can gently lift the battery out like this. Tip 7. On reassembly, some say to insert the battery into the pins first. This is to make sure the connection is good. Tip 8. Test the unit before closing it up. Tip 9. If removing the fabric, pry under the plastic. Don't pry just under the black rubber. The plastic is glued on, so you have to break the glue first. Tip 10. Unclip the fabric at the top before anything else. Here we show unclipping the other side. Here the fabric is unclipped. Peel back the fabric. This shows the end where the Bluetooth board is underneath. Tip 11. Gently pry here and the other parts separate. Sometimes the board comes apart and sometimes it stays connected. Tip 12. If you're removing the main board, look for these pins. You push the pins outwards, grab with pliers and pull them out. The pins hold the sides together. This shows the location of the four pins. Thanks for watching.